Mars is a role-playing game we've had in mind since the studio's creation, so it holds a special place in our hearts. We've developed its universe, its story and characters, and we spent a long time polishing its gameplay. We want to offer a great and immersive RPG where every choice counts, which is pretty rare for a Donald Living title. We really want Mars Warlocks to be unique. The story takes place on Mars, one century after a great upheaval that isolated the settlers from her. Different companies fighting endless wars to control water distribution, as what is now a priceless resource. Aurora, a guild supported by Technomancer powers, has just defeated its rival Abundance. You're playing White Temperance, a grim war prisoner, when the arrival of a young man offers you a perfect opportunity to escape. You discover that surviving on Mars is not an easy task, due to the dangers and political struggles that plague the planet. The sun's radiation burns the flesh and provokes irreversible mutations in the people and creatures of Mars. I promise you that facing them won't be a cakewalk. You will also fight ignomancers, who are warrior priests that manipulate reverging energy. The formidable foes and their political positions give them even more power. We wanted to give players choice about everything. Skills, feats, answers in dialogues, behavior with their companions, or even the equipment they craft. Finishing off defeated enemies will not be an easy decision either. You can lose serum from their body and get richer, but a lot of people may have a hostile reaction to your cold-blooded cure. By giving total freedom to the players, we wanted to make them own their responsibilities. We also wanted to offer rich dialogue possibilities. Your answer and tone will influence people's reactions, unlock access to side quests, prevent a battle, start a romance with the companions, or even alter the story. Mars is a dark world filled with dangers, where heavy choice counts. Get ready for your journey to Mars on PC, XBLA and PlayStation Network.